close to the historic Cumberland Gap in the far western tip of Virginia is 700 acres of blazing green pasture land. Surrounded by national forests and parks, the campus of Lincoln Memorial University's College of Veterinary Medicine is home to herds of cattle, dairy cows and horses, along with hundreds of veterinary students. Our students are here for three years on campus, and then the fourth year, they go out to a variety of practices. There are actually several hundred to choose from all over the country and have a real world veterinary hands-on experience for their clinical year, as opposed to being in a structured teaching hospital. The other thing that makes us unique is the fact that our students have literally hundreds of labs where they do hands-on tasks and learn things with their hands starting from the very first semester for all three years while they're here. So that when they leave, they have mastered the basic skills that they need to be a competent, confident veterinarian and able to contribute to the practice that they join. Like Morgan, Stacy, many of the students grew up in the Appalachian region. She's interested in large animal medicine and plans to give back to her Russell County community when she graduates. Going to LMU was an easy choice for her. Well, my first trip out here, it was such an amazing experience driving through all of the farmland and it just feels so natural, so real and there's fresh air and it's not only good for the animals but it's great for us too. You know, between classes we're able to step outside and get to view the mountains that's behind me and it's such a nice, relaxing, peaceful place for both the humans and the animals here. Amy McMurray is also from the Appalachian region. She graduated from LMU and is now a member of the staff. And she likes how the students get their hands dirty right away. Our large animal team does a lot of training with them to make sure that the students are always safe when they come to labs. And we integrate the herds in our clinical skills teaching and our clinical year teaching so they get some good hands-on opportunities. The veterinary college started in 2014, thanks to the backing of a successful local farmer and businessman. Pete DeBusk donated the 700-acre parcel in Lee County for the construction of the vet school, and he serves as chairman of the board of LMU. He believes strongly in the university's mission of providing Appalachian students a chance to advance through higher education and is proud of the school's outstanding reputation. One of the things that the American Veterinary Medical Association does, uh, through a survey, they, they, they get in touch with the students after they graduate and says, ask them, of all things, how many job offers did you have? Well, we graduated our first class last year, but remember, we're a distributive model, so we've sent these kids to many different veterinary practices to rotate for a month, then another one for a month, and they've been exposed to a lot of different settings. Well. Of course, people are going to like some of the, there's going to be areas that they really like the students. And so when our students were surveyed, all of them had several job offers. The college is one of the only high-speed internet hubs in Lee County. Folks in the community surrounding the vet school also want access to broadband, so it can grow and attract students and residents in general to the neighborhood. I think it's the jewel of Lee County, and it's certainly one of the, of, of the precious jewels in southwestern Virginia. It's starting to produce veterinarians who are serving us in Virginia. Of course, they're going other places as well, but uh, the fact that four of them have taken jobs in southwestern Virginia, uh, two in Tazewell and Russell counties, and one in Scott County, and one in Christiansburg. So we have new vets, and they're very well trained. Uh, I know personally because uh, they have, uh, two, two of them have been to my farm and um, pregnancy checked my cattle and they did a great job. Lincoln Memorial University's Veterinary College is already ranked as one of the most affordable schools in the country and every member of the first graduating class already has a position in a practice. That's good news for them of course but also for the surrounding communities and the Appalachian region it serves especially for the livestock farmers in southwest Virginia. In Lee County, Virginia, this is Dave Miller.